Mourners have gathered for a funeral in Menembwe, a remote valley in the eastern highlands of the Democratic Republic of Congo. The Banyamulenge people are burying a local herder. Bonaventure Kinyegeri was killed by one of the area's armed groups, known as Mai Mai, and his cattle stolen. We are holding a funeral ceremony. Mai Mai groups killed a herder yesterday. He's a victim of a conflict that started long ago. The strife has gone on for more than a year now. Attacks and counterattacks by armed militia claiming to represent this group or their rivals. The Banyamulenge are ethnic Tutsis whose ancestors settled here generations ago. Many people in the DRC hold deep-seated distrust of Rwanda. And the Banyamulenge are targeted by militia from other ethnicities. They've also set up their own armed groups. A few valleys away, clashes between their fighters and those of another ethnicity, the Bafuliru, destroyed the village of Bejombo. The 350 students who came to this school have scattered because of the war that broke out here. Around 7,000 Bafuliru are struggling to survive in a camp near the destroyed village. This little girl died from the harsh conditions at night, at 2,400 kilometers above sea level. Her name was Regina, which means queen. Forces from the United Nations and the Congolese army have deployed nearby to keep the displaced people safe. But many women have been kidnapped by militia when they ventured back to their fields. Congolese Defence Minister Emeng Goy has visited the area, promising security. They need the military. It must be reinforced, motivated. The military must be organised. The government must assert its authority, re-establish the state's authority. Far away in the capital Kinshasa, there have been protests against the government's officialization of the Banyamulenge's territory. President Felix Tsisekedi revoked the recognition and has promised to set up an expert commission to redefine their territorial limits. Meanwhile, whether over tribalism or cattle rustling, the attacks continue.